Have you ever wondered how McDonald's, the global fast food giant, navigated the complex Indian market? The journey of this household name is as intriguing as it is inspiring. McDonald's, the beacon of American fast food culture, has a presence that spans the globe, with its iconic golden arches lighting up cityscapes in over a hundred countries. It's a brand that stands for consistency, speed, and a universally appealing menu. But the journey hasn't been without its share of bumps, especially in India. In 1996, McDonald's ventured into the Indian market, a move that was as ambitious as it was challenging. The Indian market was a labyrinth of complexity, with its diverse palate, cultural nuances, and unique dietary preferences. The land of spices and curries was a far cry from the usual terrain McDonald's was accustomed to. India is a country where vegetarianism is not just a dietary choice, but a way of life for a significant portion of the population. This meant that the typical McDonald's menu had to undergo a radical transformation. The beef-laden Big Macs and cheeseburgers that were McDonald's signatures had no place here. In their stead came the Makalu Tiki and the McVeggy, burgers that catered to the Indian palate and respected the dietary norms of the land. But the challenges were not just limited to the menu. The business climate in India, with its red tape and regulatory hurdles, presented a whole new set of obstacles. McDonald's had to navigate this unfamiliar territory with caution and tact. And then there was the competition. The Indian fast food market was already crowded with local players who understood the pulse of the people. Breaking into this market and carving out a niche was no mean feat for McDonald's. The entry was certainly not a cakewalk, but the real test was about to begin. The trials and tribulations of McDonald's in India were far from over. The Golden Arches had a long and winding road ahead. Stay tuned as we delve deeper into this fascinating journey. What happens when a global giant fails to understand a diverse market like India? Well, the narrative of McDonald's in India gives us just the answer. The global fast food conglomerate, known for its iconic Golden Arches, faced a challenging endeavor in the Indian market. The brand's image and strategies, which worked wonders globally, didn't quite hit the mark in the Indian context. So what exactly went wrong? Firstly, McDonald's underestimated the power of the Indian palate. Their standard global menu failed to resonate with the Indian taste buds, which craved for a blend of spicy and savory. While they did introduce a few India-specific items, it wasn't enough to win over the food-loving Indians. Secondly, the brand faced a significant backlash for not aligning with India's diverse cultural and religious sentiments. Despite making efforts to adapt, like introducing a separate vegetarian menu, the controversies surrounding beef and pork products in their food created a negative image. The third factor was the stiff competition. The Indian market was already flooded with local fast food chains that offered similar products at much lower prices. McDonald's, with its higher pricing, struggled to justify the cost value to the price-sensitive Indian consumers. Then came the internal disputes. The joint venture with their Indian partner Vikram Bakshi turned sour, leading to a legal battle. This internal turmoil added fuel to the fire, further tarnishing the brand's image and causing operational disruptions. Despite the brand's efforts to adapt and overcome these challenges, the damage was done. In 2017, McDonald's exited the Indian market, closing down more than 160 outlets in North and East India. This exit was a significant blow to the company's global expansion plans and a shock to the fast food industry. The exit of McDonald's from India was a shocker, but was it the end? Well, as the saying goes, failure is the stepping stone to success, and this was just the beginning of a new chapter for the Golden Arches in India. Stay tuned as we delve into how McDonald's made a comeback in the Indian market in the next scene. How does a brand make a comeback after a major setback in a market? That's the question McDonald's had to answer when they decided to re-enter the Indian market in 2019. Faced with the challenge of re-establishing their reputation, McDonald's had to rethink their approach. They recognized the need to understand and cater to the unique tastes and preferences of Indian consumers. The first step was to localize their menu, a strategy that proved to be a game-changer. They introduced more vegetarian options and regional favorites like the Makalu Tiki and Maharaja Mac, which were instant hits. They also ensured that their kitchens were separated for vegetarian and non-vegetarian food preparation, 
respecting the dietary habits of a significant portion of the Indian population. McDonald's also implemented a competitive pricing strategy, understanding the price-sensitive nature of the Indian market. They ensured their menu items were affordable, increasing their appeal to a broader audience. This affordability, combined with the brand's global appeal, made McDonald's a preferred choice for many Indian consumers. Understanding the Indian consumer behavior was another key aspect of McDonald's strategy. They recognized the importance of family and Indian culture and began positioning their outlets as family-friendly spaces. They also tapped into the trend of convenience and quick service, offering home delivery options and drive throughs which were well received by the time-pressed urban population. McDonald's also leveraged their global reputation for consistency and quality. They emphasized their commitment to maintaining high standards, ensuring that a meal at McDonald's in India was just as satisfying as anywhere else in the world. The combination of these strategies helped McDonald's re-establish their presence in the Indian market. They managed to turn around their fortunes proving that understanding and adapting to local tastes, preferences and behaviors is crucial for success in any market. McDonald's re-entry was a lesson in understanding and adapting to local markets. Their success story serves as a blueprint for any brand looking to make a comeback or establish a foothold in a new market. So, where does McDonald's stand in the Indian market today? Fast forward to our current timeline and McDonald's has become an inseparable part of the Indian fast food industry. From the bustling streets of Mumbai to the tech parks of Bangalore, the golden arches shine brightly, symbolizing a story of resilience and adaptation. McDonald's has found its footing in the Indian market by successfully tailoring its strategies to cater to the local palate and preferences. The menu boasts a range of vegetarian options, a direct reflection of the country's dietary habits. The Makalu Tiki Burger and the Veg Maharaja Mac, for example, are favorites among the locals, demonstrating McDonald's ability to integrate into the Indian culinary landscape. But the success story doesn't end with an innovative menu. McDonald's has also made strides in understanding the Indian consumer's mindset. They've positioned themselves not just as a fast food joint, but as a family-friendly restaurant where memories are created. This approach has resonated with Indian consumers who value community and family time. In terms of market share, McDonald's has carved out a significant portion for itself. While exact figures can be elusive in the dynamic world of fast food, it's clear that McDonald's is now a formidable player in the Indian market. Their numerous outlets, both in metropolitan cities and smaller towns, stand testament to their success. Their popularity among Indian consumers is palpable. From college students grabbing a quick bite between classes to families enjoying a Sunday meal together, McDonald's has found a place in the everyday lives of millions of Indians. Their affordability, coupled with their consistent quality, has made them a go-to choice for many. McDonald's journey in India is a testament to the fact that understanding and adapting to a foreign market is crucial. It's a journey of learning from failures, adapting strategies, and ultimately, emerging victorious. So, the next time you pass by a McDonald's outlet, remember, it's more than just a restaurant. It's a symbol of adaptability and resilience. It's a story of how a global giant learned to dance to the tunes of a different culture. Despite the initial stumble, today McDonald's has carved a niche for itself in the Indian fast food industry. McDonald's journey in India is more than just a business case study. It's a story of resilience, adaptability, and a deep understanding of the Indian consumer. Let's take a step back and recap this fascinating journey. McDonald's first entry into India was met with much fanfare. However, the initial excitement soon faded as the company faced challenges in adapting to the local palate and cultural sensitivities. They struggled with vegetarian and non-vegetarian menus, and the taste profile simply didn't resonate with the Indian audience. This led to the eventual exit of the Golden Arches from the Indian market. But McDonald's didn't give up. They took their exit as an opportunity to learn and adapt. They reflected upon their mistakes and made a strategic re-entry into the Indian market. This time, they came prepared. They revamped their menu to cater to Indian taste buds, introduced a clear distinction between vegetarian and non-vegetarian products, and focused on locally sourced ingredients. And their efforts paid off. 
Today, McDonald's is not only surviving but thriving in the Indian market. They have successfully captured the hearts of Indian consumers, becoming a beloved fast food chain across the country. Their journey in India is a testament to their adaptability and deep understanding of the market they operate in. What can we learn from this journey? Well, it's simple. In a globalized world, understanding cultural nuances and adapting to local tastes is not just an advantage, it's a necessity. Businesses cannot afford to impose a one-size-fits-all approach in diverse markets. They need to be flexible, adaptable and sensitive to the local culture and preferences. The story of McDonald's in India is a testament to the fact that understanding and adapting to local cultures and tastes is the key to success in a diverse market like India. It's a lesson in resilience, adaptability and the power of understanding your consumer. It's a story that inspires businesses to learn, adapt and grow, no matter the challenges they face.